in a services context, quality is very variable in terms of the perceptions. When we've got a physical product, and like I said, I only work in services mostly. I do some work in product, but mostly services. Mm -hmm. Services has a lot more diverse perspectives of what is quality and what is value and what isn't because so much is dependent on personal perspective uh, because you can't touch and feel and hold the product often. So what a lot of uh, businesses do is they try to create a physical representation of the service with booklets or charts or you know PowerPoints and that kind of thing to help mm -hmm. visualize that quality. But essentially you're buying something inherently intangible. Um, so uh, you know, that's your first thing is like the variability in perspective over what is quality. So one of the things um, you really want to delineate is what is table stakes quality and what is uh, quality that people are prepared to pay for that is different in the market. And when we're working in the business, in our business, we can we can really lose that perspective because we understand more via the cursor knowledge. This is a this is a sort of human bias, by the way, that um, the more you know about your product and your category, the more you assume everyone else to know the same thing as what you do. And that is <laughs> yeah. never the case, uh, which is why the longer you are in your business, the harder this is and the more uh, severe this bias becomes, which is why you always should get independent people or do rounds of market research on a, on a really um, consistent basis to get that sort of baseline. Um, so when customers are making decisions, they're often making it without all that context and knowledge of your product quality. So they don't know and they can't discern the same things in the same way that you can. So often they're using piecemeal uh, information a tiny bit. They're using talking to a friend going, oh, what do you think of that? Oh, yeah, I think that company is good. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. They don't understand why. It's all just a, a vibe and a perception. So the problem with quality is if you focus too much on the actual product offering and engineering that too much, that doesn't uh, increase the value perceptions by the customer. That is just a road to, to nothingness. It doesn't have any mm -hmm. effect on, on your market. So yeah, value breakdown is really key there.